the other side. So, for today's video, I thought I would just do kind of like a sit down, let's chat type of video. Um, like kind of like a little bit of an update video really um, because I had no idea what to film for today and I feel like it's been a while since I've just really sat down and talked with you guys over here on this channel so um, I just wanted to do that for this video for today so first things first that I'm going to start off with is my haunted doll my haunted doll has not arrived yet but I believe it is in Australia I think it is in Australia now because um, the tracking that you get from Etsy is kind of confusing so I don't really know if it is in Australia or if it's not I don't know it's very confusing the tracking that Etsy gives you um, to like track your package so I believe that it has arrived in Australia but I haven't gotten anything since then um, since it has arrived so hopefully she is on her way um, it's taken a very long time for her to arrive and I know that you guys just want to see her and I really want to see her and um, yeah so I think I bought her like at the start of this month like I think on the 3rd of February or something like that I don't know um, but I know it was like the start of this month and it's taken a while for her to get here um, but I understand she's coming from Chicago so um, that's a very long way away from here um, so yeah I'm not surprised that she's taking a while to get here but as soon as she arrives whatever day it is I'm going to um, film me unboxing her for you guys and introduce her to you all and I cannot wait for her to arrive so hopefully she'll arrive maybe this week who knows um, but uh, yes yeah, so she uh, has had a very long journey so far so um, it will be nice for her to finally be here and um, yeah hopefully she isn't like damaged because if she is that will be very sad um, so fingers crossed that she comes like all in one piece um, so yeah I am just so excited for her to arrive um, she does have a name but I don't want to say the name of her um, until she um, like arrives um, and obviously I've been saying she so it's like a female doll what I've like noticed about these haunted dolls all of them really seem to be female spirits like there's very rarely male spirit like haunted dolls um, and when I was looking it was mainly female spirit um, haunted dolls so um, I am really looking forward to meeting her and um, yeah I hope you guys are as well so when she arrives there'll be lots of videos all about my haunted doll and I just can't wait so she is still on her way but I think she has arrived in Australia I'm not too sure yet but I don't know, I'll have to like double check with the tracking and see what's going on. Um, but yeah, if she does arrive this week, then um, as soon as she does, I will do an unboxing video and um, introduce her all to you guys. And uh, yeah, um, also, um, I wanted to talk about um, my last video that I did, my spirit box session. That was insane I was not expecting those results and that knocking that I heard when I was editing I was like hang on I did not hear that knocking in person and I was staying completely still um, when that knocking happened I was standing completely still and I just heard it when I was editing I was like hang on and that sounds like someone like knocking on my um, on my uh, what is it my drawers I was standing on my drawers um, that uh, are in there and um, yeah I was uh, really surprised to hear that when I was editing I was like what that can't be it but I was I remember I was standing completely still and I did, did not hear that knocking in person and some of the like results we got from the spirit box was kind of crazy um, so I think that was one of my like new favorite videos ever that I've done and my favorite like spirit box session that I've ever done so I hope you guys really liked last week's video because I loved it and I loved editing it it was a lot of fun and um, yeah I was not expecting those results at all because my house is like not haunted at all so um, yeah I was very surprised with what we gathered in that video so I hope you guys liked that um, I just wanted to talk about that in this video because yeah I was just not expecting to get those type of results um, so yeah it was really good a really good video last week really liked that um, if you have not watched it yet go and watch it because it's really good um, but yeah so now with what I have planned for the future 
of this channel so i know we're only in february of this year um like we're only in the second month of the year um but i have lots of ideas i really want to like go out onto like locations and do more location type of videos but it's just hard for me because i don't have my license like i can't drive so I really want to like do more things like out in the field I guess um, and it is kind of hard for me and like there aren't that many like haunted places here in Brisbane um, that I think you can like rent out for an investigation but I don't know I'm gonna try and like uh, do some research because I know I've never done like an investigation before um, so I really really want to but I just don't know where I can do that because or how I can do that so I know I've never done an investigation but I just really really want to because I feel like I'm a paranormal channel and I really need to start getting into like proper investigating um so yeah because I have like no investigations on this channel um, which feels weird because it is a paranormal channel so I don't know I just feel like I really want to do more investigations this year and um yeah so hopefully i'll be able to do that and um yeah i just really want to achieve that for this year that's one of my goals for 2020 this year for this channel is to do investigations and um like you guys will be obviously i'll be taking you guys along with me if i do ever get to go to a haunted location and investigate it so um yeah i will like start looking into some places um and um yeah so hopefully i'll be able to do more of that this year and um yeah i just i know i've just never like been able to do it before um, because like I said I can't drive so that is one like major thing um, for me so and um, yeah I just need to start looking at places just to see there is one place that I really want to go to that is out in Warwick and my mum has stayed there before and so um, it is this like old um, it used to be like a nunnery I think believe I think it used to be a nunnery um, but my mom has stayed there before and they don't like the place they don't really um, it's like a bed and breakfast now um, but they don't really um, uh, I guess they don't really talk about the ghosts like it's not advertised on their website that it's haunted so I don't know if I'd be able to do anything there um, because they don't really advertise it um, but they do have a couple of creepy things happen there like I remember my mum stayed there um, I think it's called Abbey of the Roses I think that's what it's called um, and it is in Warwick and when my mum stayed there she stayed there with my auntie her sister um, and her mum my nana so she stayed there with them and they stayed in the attic room and they said they heard lots of crazy things go like in the night go off in the night like they heard the toilet flushing on its own and they heard just like footsteps and stuff and apparently there is this window on I think it's like on the staircase or something that there's a handprint of a child's handprint and they just cannot get it off like they've tried to like clean it, the window and they cannot get it off so um, yeah that is kind of like creepy and really awesome at the same time because uh, obviously it was used to be a nunnery so um, they think that um, one of the nuns possibly has had like had a child there and was obviously kept secret so um, yeah I definitely want to go to that um, place one time because it would just be awesome and it would be an amazing place to investigate and it looks really nice as well um, so hopefully I don't know I'll, I'll try and get my mum into going there sometime this year I don't know how but I just really want to go there um, maybe for her birthday or something I don't know but um, I really really want to go there and investigate it because it would just be amazing and I definitely would want to stay in the attic because that would be really cool and creepy so 
yeah, I definitely want to go there um, because it looks like a really cool and awesome place. So yeah, that is one of my top places that I want to investigate at. And um, yeah, I also really want to investigate at Port Arthur because um, you can do paranormal investigations at Port Arthur and my mum said she wouldn't want to do that as well. So I don't think it's going to be happening this year, but sometime in the future we'll do it because that would be really awesome and they like provide you with paranormal equipment and you can bring cameras along and stuff and um, catch evidence. So that would be a really awesome thing to do as well and obviously I will bring you guys along with me if we ever do that one um, but my, even my mum said she would really like to do that one so yeah those are just a few of the places that I really want to investigate I think Port Arthur would be amazing um, so yeah I just really want to do more investigations this year because I've never done one like a proper investigation so I hope that I can do that for this year for 2020 so that's a new year's resolution of mine um, but yeah so I think that is it um, for this video. I think that's everything that I really have to catch up with you guys. Um, and yeah, I just didn't really know what else to film for today. I felt like I needed like a proper catch up with you guys and like proper talk with you guys of what's like going on with my Horned Doll and like what's really like been going on in my head um, and like stuff that I've been planning for this channel for this year. Um, so yeah, I just... I'm super excited for the rest of this year and I hope you guys are as well. Um, also, now that I think of it, uh, it just like popped up in my head. Next month there is a Friday the 13th and you guys know if you've been with me for a while that I used to do Friday the 13th week on this channel when it was a week where um, it ended with a Friday the 13th and I would upload every single day in that week and I would dress up as well. So there is a Friday the 13th next week, not next week, um, next month <laughs> in March. So I'm going to be doing a Friday the 13th week next month. So super excited about that. So I thought I would let you guys know about that now um, whilst it just like popped up into my head. So super excited about that. I'm going to have a new background that we costumes and um, yeah, I'll dress up every day and I am super excited about that and I hope you guys are as well. So that will be next month in March. Um, so yeah, super looking forward to that. Um, and yeah, I think, again, I think that's everything that I have to, um, catch up with you guys and, like, talk to you guys about. And, um, yeah, so I hope that you guys liked this little update video. I just kind of wanted to do it for today. Uh, since I had really no other plans for this, uh, for today. Um, but I just really, like I said, wanted to... Um, tell you guys what uh, like the stuff the plans that I've been thinking of doing for this channel for the rest of this year so yeah um, but anyway so I'm going to head off for now if you guys like this video make sure to give it a thumbs up make sure to subscribe and I will see you all maybe this week if my haunted doll arrives but if not then I'll see you all um, again next week for another video all right bye guys <laughs>